Hey guys, we have the Tractor 2.6.6 Windows update. Well, it's for the Mac as well too, but we're looking at the Windows one at the moment. Uh, finally, we have the Remix Deck Mappings for Machine Controller. They finally fixed the meta data sync with Tractor DJ and the iOS 7 bullshit. <laughs> Sorry, but it is bullshit. And uh, they fixed the crash when selecting a custom root directory location. I never ran into that issue myself personally, but Apparently there was an issue and they fixed it. Now I'm going to show you something that you need to know when you update your tractor system, whether it be Windows or Mac. Hold on a second, I'll be right back. Okay, so here's the deal. And uh, I had to do this video a couple times because I really don't want to be showing every goddamn document in my folder, you know what I mean? So when you go into my your documents folder, there's a folder called Native Instruments. Insert with the finger being in the way. So when you go in the Native Instruments folder and you open it up, you have in there the tractor folder. When you open that up, your backup, your cover art, your crash logs, your history, your logs, your settings, your stripe. That's the big one. Three gig. That's a lot of transients. 407 meg. And, you know, your history, of course, not so bad. But one of the deals is, let's go back again here. See how that says Tractor 2.6.4? Well, I'm going to show you something. I'm going to install the update right now. I'm going to uh, use the magic of the internet, and we're going to pause the video. When I come back, I'm going to show you what it looks like after the install. Oh, one more quick thing, really. I'm just at the part where uh, install hardware driver has every goddamn driver for every goddamn thing they ever made. So you know what? I don't have an audio 2, an audio 4, an audio 8. Uh, tractor audio MK2 driver. Uh, no. Uh, no. Uh, audio 2 DJ driver. That's There's all kinds of shit going on here. Hmm, install tractor audio. No, no. Nope. Oh, yep, I got an F1. Let's go back here. X1, nope. Z1, nope. No Z2. No S2. No MK2 S2. But I do have an S4. Mm, no Z2. That's it. So you select what you have. There's no sense wasting space and installing a bunch of drivers you'll never use. But, on the other hand, if you have friends that have audio twos and stuff like that, or whatever, they come over to your place, you know what? Might be uh, not a bad idea to install some of the things. If you know you have a buddy that they're going to let you borrow their X1 or some shit. Uh, so, let's see if there's anything else. Uh, nope. Hit the next and... Cross your fingers and we'll be back. This has taken way too long. The compute and space requirements. This is an i5 processor. This thing has 8 gig of RAM. You know, it's uh, a Dell XPS. You know what I mean? Like, it's not a joke. <laughs> but why is it taking so long? Well, it's going to hit pause here and uh, let's see what the hell's going on here. Oh, there we go. Oh, finally. Like, what's it doing? Was it like sending a message to God? I don't know. So many things that this thing pops in. Mappings. Controller mappings. For all these goddamn controllers I'm never going to use. You know what? That's kind of bullshit. That's all right for guys who don't know any better. But this is software for some intelligent people. I'd rather pick and choose my controller. I'm only using one. So all these mappings for all this shit. I don't know. Go on to the forums, guys. Let's bitch and complain. Tell Native Instruments, stop eating my hard drive, man. Stop. You want to want to feed my hard drive or something? How about some more of these uh, free remix sets? Uh, hopefully this thing's good, man, because I'm getting sick of that old shit. I don't got time to make my own remix sets. You know what I mean? Like... I'm an instant gratification kind of guy. Anyways, hold on. I'll be right back. Okay, I told you guys I was going to make a long-ass video. I didn't say anything about it being short. 
Hope these stuck around. We're looking at the at the MacBook Pro now. And there's our little installer package. Let's crack that thing open. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's gonna run a thing, see if it can be determined. Let's try and get this into focus. It doesn't like focusing on a Mac. The Mac's being shy today. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yes, of course we agree. Why wouldn't we like stupid stuff? Once again, we got to go in here and deselect some stuff. But you know what? Mm, there isn't that much shit. Look, there isn't that much. Not as much as on Windows at all. On your two, on your six, on your that. That's weird that it doesn't have a... You notice that? There's no F1 driver. Mm, just continue. Oh, who's this John Doe character? <laughs> Anyways, if you want to know the story behind John Doe, it was just uh, I bought the computer used. I bought it off a guy. He reformatted and, you know, he put John Doe in there and I just haven't changed it. And you know what? I probably won't. Uh, continue. <laughs> Look at this. Validate packages right into files. Stupid Windows, man. I swear, like, nobody knows how to program that stuff. It sat there for, like, a good three minutes, no doubt, trying to, uh, just doing nothing. Trying to figure out to calculate space. Like, I mean, calculate space. I got a terabyte in that goddamn computer. So there's more than enough space. That's an i5. This is a dual core 2.6, no, a 2.26 or something. Mid 2009 with a solid state hard drive in it. And you know what? Well, that shit over there, I'm looking over at the PC and it's still installing f God knows what. And I've been this is about a minute. I'm like, I tell you, it's going to install faster. Than the goddamn i5. Because you know what? Macs is. They're more efficient. The programming behind it. That's why I'm letting it run. We're seven minutes in man. Like, I hope you guys actually stuck around. Because like shit. What's the point of making a video. If nobody's going to watch this stuff right? <sighs> I don't want to wait a minute. I'm going to pause it again. Okay, so the first thing you go to run it, it's going to ask you, do you want to import your collection and preferences from the previous installment? It's recommended. Click no to start with an empty collection. Well, if you're like me, you spend a lot of time analyzing your shit, so of course you want to import it. Should tractor import to the default path on your main drive? Recommended. Mm, well, I guess so, right? We'll see. In the real. So here, you know what, and let me just cut to the chase, because you know what, this is going to take fucking forever. What it's doing right now, see where it says copy in the file? And let's see if we can maybe catch this in the process. Ah, we did catch it. It made a whole new fucking folder called Tracker 2.6.6. So what this bitch is doing is it's eating your shit. It's eating your hard drive up because it's going to take those three gigs that you saw before with the transients, with the stripes, and it's going to add another goddamn three gig. And the reason for it apparently is, well, so you can, if you want to backtrack because, you know, if the new update's a piece of shit, you need to downgrade, which quite often we need to. Everything's sitting there. But what I don't really understand is, why couldn't the software just rename the 2.6.4 to 2.6.6? And you know what? Once my shit's done, I hate to play around because I got a DJ like a big gig at New Year's Eve and I'm doing like stuff on the weekend. So I don't really want to fuck around with my tractor shit too much. But I almost suspect if you told that, don't copy, don't make a new one. Let's start with a fresh one. And you wouldn't, and you just rename that shit yourself, it would probably be fine. 
You know what I mean? I don't know that for an absolute fact, but I'm going to test it out at some point very soon. So let me go take a look at this Mac, see what's going on. Well, the Mac wanted to restart right off the bat for product activation, so let's see what happens. Hey, we're back. So here we are looking at the same thing on the Mac. And you know what? I think I'm going to tell it to start with an empty collection. That's exactly it. I'm going to tell it, like, you know what? Fuck it. Just start with an empty one. Spinning beach ball. Attention, meta does think can't be performing tracks while we're being okay. Copying all these goddamn controller things. I don't know if you can make that up. You can't make that shit up. I'm sorry. But yeah, 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 yeah. I want to go through the sub wizard. But you know what? I'm not going to go through the sub wizard. Okay. Well, I guess we have no choice. Right at this point, we have to. Next, 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 just fucking next, just fucking finish. Sorry for the swearing, I just, I can't help it. I'm tired. So we're going to quit this. Right? Um, open up Finder. Go into John Doe. Go into the documents. Native Instruments. And you see, oh, there we go. So we have two folders, right? One folder here. Has, um, let's look at the stripes. Okay, tons of them, right? So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to we're going to rename. Let's get some info on it. And 83 meg. Okay, doesn't have much in it, right? Let me look at this one here. Get info. That one there. Mm, calculate, and it's going to be big. Yeah, we got like 738 meg there. So I don't have all my collection there. So, I have that. Give me one second here. Okay, guys, I hate to admit this shit because I did work at Apple once upon a time, a long time ago. <laughs> but stupid as shit, man. I couldn't honestly figure out how to rename the goddamn folder. So I'm going to call this one 2.6.6A. You want to keep... We're going to use this one. Okay, so the folder's changed. You know what? Like, that's why it kills me. I've been a Windows user for like a while now. You right-click, you rename, double-click. There's all kinds of shit you can do. That's a pretty bullshit way to change a file name. But anyways, so right-click, get info. I'm sure some guy's going to send me a message going, oh, you know, there's a very fast way to do that. And there probably is. That probably is because this seems like bullshit. We're gonna call this one 2.2.6. The return. Nah, nah, nah. I'm gonna use the six. So now let's see what happens when I open up Tractor. Everything should be smooth, I would hope. And oh yeah, because right off the bat, it's looking for my external drive. So hold on, let me go plug it in. Okay, moment of truth. Screen looks like what I'm used to looking at. It says it's loading the collection. It shouldn't take a long goddamn time to load the collection. Shit, you can't go full screen when you're waiting for that. Who knows? Maybe this wasn't a good idea. <laughs> Hard to say, right? 
because like on my Mac that uh, my collection is really not that big. Now you guys are always bitching about like you know brightness and stuff. And... There. That's taking way too goddamn long. We're 15 minutes into this video, man. I'm sorry, guys. We're going to pause this and see what's going on. Well, just a little update. This thing here is still copying this shit over. Because, you know, it's got 3 gig and moving around like fuck. And I'm looking over at the Mac, and that shit's still loading the collection. So I don't know what's going on. Hold on. Okay, here's something. It, it was doing that, and then all of a sudden it started doing all these sudden things. So let's look. Hey guys, fuck, I was doing a lot of talking there for a second. I don't even know where I left off. I thought I was recording. So, as it seems, that um, my Stripe is, you know, it says I have transients. Is there anything that has transients and Stripe? Okay, that one apparently had... You know, now on this one here, I don't even really know what's analyzed, what's not. So it does look like what I just did worked. It doesn't need to analyze it all over again. So I'm just going to have to play around with it and see if there's any issues with it. But so far, it um it looks like it's okay. And uh, yeah, we're at 2 point. Come on, get in there and focus. Yeah, just fuck. One of these days I'm going to have to have a better way. People have been bitching about my shit. 2.6.6 .6 is in there. I'm going to do another quick video. Try this goddamn mapping up for the machine because that's something we all want to see, right? I'm not going to continue on with this long ass shit. 17 minutes into it, you guys are long gone. I'm talking to nobody at this point. If you're still around, leave a comment and fucking humor me. Say something. Talk to you guys later.